According to Microsoft 3-year development cycle, Windows 12 should be releasing in 2024, but it is not happening because Microsoft planning to release Windows 11 version 24H2, which is basically based on some improvement, new features, and most of the things related to AI. Okay, so if it is not happening, let's see what are the new features coming to Windows 11 version 24H2. After watching this video, you will definitely learn so many things. You will be pro guy in Windows 11. First thing, you can use your mobile phone as a webcam in your Windows PC. This feature is also available in macOS. Now it is available on Windows. First, you have to install your phone link app in your Android phone. Also, you need to install it in your Windows. Go into Bluetooth and devices and mobile devices settings. And here you will see option like allow this PC to access your mobile phone devices. Just turn it on and click on manage devices. You can see option like use as a connected camera. Whatever the apps required webcam like your recording video using OBS studio many other apps. You need to turn on this feature. After that, go on store and check for update. You will get update of cross devices experience host. Now I'm opening my camera. Switch the camera here. Here you will see Realme 7 Pro connected. Now my phone is connected to this PC and I'm using as a webcam. Totally depends upon your use cases. Another big update related to file explorer. Right click on any file you will see a labels like a cut copy paste and delete. Another feature they added native support for RAR files and zip files and tar file. Many more additional options here. You can choose according to you like which format you want to compress the file. So now you don't need to install WinRAR and other third party apps to compress the file. Another thing they bring back tags in the files. So right click on any file and go to properties. Go into details. Here you can see tags option. So what it does basically if you add any tag here whenever you are going to find your file you will find it easily. Like uh, I'm going to search for it Windows 11. Now you will see your file here. Another thing Microsoft adding copilot and right click context menu whenever you click on any file you can directly send to copilot. Another big update related to copilot. Copilot is now a standalone app. This thing you can manage from three dots like side by side. And now this copilot can do much more things with your systems. You can ask for Wi-Fi networks. You can ask for battery informations and many more commands. I will put in description. You can just go through it. I just asked for show startup apps. It is going to show all the startup app list. So you can copy paste wherever you want. You can create an Excel file of these lists. If I go and explain each and every command, this is going to be a longer video that I'm going to cover in another video. So this can also clean your recycle bin. New features related to your quick setting, go here and uh, go to Wi-Fi. You will see here refresh icon in your Wi-Fi. Now you can refresh your Wi-Fi connections from here and you can click on info to get all the info related to that Wi-Fi. Another improvement is scrollable settings here. So whenever you scroll using your mouse, you will see other settings also. They also added live caption in your quick settings. So just go and enable it in a just one single click. Another great improvement related to your power settings. So go into power. Here you will see energy saver. So this setting is available on your laptop and PC as well. So this is going to be save your energy or power. Another improvement, they have added lit power sleep button. This setting was in control panel. Now it is moved to Windows setting. Another great improvement, they added sudo commands here. So let me show you the example here. Whenever you are opening command prompt directly like this or you are putting some commands, you need administrator privileges. So for that, you need to go in developer settings and enable this sudo command here. And now again, go and open this command prompt without administrator and type the same command again you will get the same error but if you put sudo before that command now your command is working perfectly fine another feature i personally like like in the task whenever any app just uh, not responding you don't need to go on your task manager and in the task you can directly in the task from your taskbar another feature like whenever I go on any web page and sharing click on windows share you will see a QR code option here. So you can scan and open directly in your phone. So that's a great improvement. They have added font section. You can drag and drop any font. You can add new fonts here. Another bad feature or improvement they added here like so recommendation for tips, shortcuts, new apps and ads. They are going to show you ads also. So best thing is you can turn it off from here. It will not show in your system. And for that, you need to go into privacy settings and in general, turn off all these settings if you don't want to see ads in your system. Another improvement related to your snap layout so they are adding some AI snapping layout so it will suggest to you like which is the best one and will show you on your snap view so you can select according to you new things they added in the snapping tool just go to settings here you will see HDR screenshot turn on this setting so if your monitor supports then you will see best screenshot for your system and you can also record video with your system sound and microphone so this app is really improved and they also improved the snapping tool take a screenshot you can add shapes here like rectangle circle arrow line so whatever
whatever you want you can change the color also they added the animation whenever you are recognizing text from image so this is a great improvement by microsoft i hope you guys like this video so hit the like button and do comment so algorithm will understand like this is a good video and they are going to recommend some other people this is going to be helpful for them